Hi everybody, it's Eva and welcome to my channel Revy Plus. In today's episode, I would like to do just a quick uh, video about a uh, tutorial about Vera, Vera and how ca can we use Vera for interior design. Okay, so let's start it. If you don't know the app, uh, Vera is a <clears throat> is an add-in that is developed by Evil Lab. And I will leave you the description below in my in my comments, and as well I will leave you the, um, uh, the prompts that I used to do these uh, renders. Okay, so let's start it. So, uh, well, for this for this example, I'm going to start showing all my prompts, and as well the the sample that I took is the Revit model, architectural Revit model, that the sample that is coming with all Revit. Okay, so let's start it for this. This is the, the prompt. Uh, that I use for my first uh, renders and uh, and we are going to show you this don't worry if the, you don't need to write down the prompt I will leave you in my in the description below description below so this is uh, the the living room and um, in this case I, I wanted to uh, something in the tones in the beige tones and like a gold light and yeah so like a very very neutral so this is is the, the prompt that I wrote and as well is I click as a, it's an interior and uh, you have to activate aerial view as well and you have here the creativity is 95 style strength 34 with the total width and number of renders you can render four renders uh, at once so okay so let's see the results so this is one resource number one image number one that's my second image the number two uh, third uh, number three and this one number four okay next we are going to change the prompt now and this is my second prompt uh, where I was using similar prompts but I changed by golden carpet let's see the results okay again creativity strength is 95 style strength is 34 the width is the total width and the number of rendering is number four okay let's see the results so it's more uh, golden light how you can see and as well the furniture you have like a golden uh, reflections and the light the lighting as well on the ceiling and next you can see more the um yes yeah, the background is a lot with a lot of green which is i like it's really nice and the light as well and you can see the chairs and then the the, the mini table the small table is uh, has a, a gold finishes and, and as well in the ceiling room okay next so that's similar very very similar with a little more clarity in, or light white light in 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 the interior so next uh and here it changed the, the floor because I said a carpet, but now it's showing like a kind of a timber timber floor, but it's okay, that's fine. So next, I'm going to change my prompt now, and I'm going to say uh, similar similar prompts, but I will change a dark for dark brown carpet. So let's see the results. So again, creativity strength is 95, style strength is 34, the width is total width and the number of renderings is number four okay so let's see the results so in this case yes i said a uh, dark brown so how you can see it's the carpet is, is dark it's a dark brown and the, the sofas and everything in general is in these tones next so very similar uh, so here it's just more of the, the light is too dark i guess it's just but it's okay okay next uh, similar results but very it's just, just like a change in the light uh, the in general uh, next and here okay so here is changing some details like for example this light uh, just is a, is a, you know different kind of like a gold shine shiny and this the chairs as well and the table next okay so here I'm going to change again my uh, prompt I'm going to say that it's going to be like a red carpet now okay so let's see the results so creativity strength is 95 style strength is 34 width is a uh, total width number of renderings is number four okay so let's see the results 
Okay, so that is a red a color so fast and it's really nice and still keeping the sun golden lights and on the ceilings, lightings on the ceilings. Next is more here is, is combining, I like that. It's combining black, uh sorry, uh white and red uh for the sofas and then signs this kind of like a, a different material beige for this the lamp i think and this for the sofas i guess not too bad next uh here it's just we have more white for the sofas for these chairs and gold and sun and in general the the sofas are red that's not too bad okay so next uh okay so here it's just it's just converting all the chairs in a gold color and uh, as well as the lamp uh, and it's mixing in the in the lighting and the ceiling i like that so next okay so now we are going to change here a different prompt as well uh so now we are going to focus on black carpet so let's see the results so this is my again that's the tools that you have to use so creativity strength 95 style strength 34 the width total width and the number of renderings number four okay so let's see the results so how you can see now is it's all is in a black mainly a black color for the sofas and it's a combination of the chairs i like that it's com combining black and white i like this kind of thing and the light the light here the lamp it's really nice uh okay next so here it's more I, I really like that it's more like a luxury um lamp here and as well it's combining beige and black it's not too bad but the carpet look the carpet it looks like a brown and i said mm, okay so maybe it's not mm, appropriate but well let's next okay so here it's more like a beige okay so tone tones like a gold tones that's fine it's okay so combining black and white i like that and gold as, as well nice and next is all is a lack in black predominant and then black and gold which is, is nice as well okay so next we are going to change again our prompt and in this case we are going to say black and white carpet okay so let's see the results so here uh yes again you have to use creativity strength 95 style strength 34 with total width number of renderings renderings number four okay so let's see okay okay so this is still like a black and white okay i really like that it's a really quite quite nice and look at the the background it's just is matching as well as slightly so it's like a kind of like a snowing or just winter background nice next so next uh it's continuing in the same tones black and white but it's combining yeah uh with the sun the lamp is white and chairs and gold that's nice okay next okay that's the next so so we have a yeah predominant black and some chairs like it could be like a silver maybe as a silver is something that i didn't try before maybe i can try in my next prompt i really like this image is that really because it's a, the carpet is like a really natural lot and in tone so it's it's making a lot of contrast contrast with the sofas and it's really nice this next Okay, so here I changed again my prompt, and now we are going to focus on grey gray carpet. Sorry, so let's see the results. Again, creativity strength is 95, style strength 34, width is total width, number of rendering number four. And okay, let's see the results. Um, okay, so it's a very very uh, neutral tones like uh yeah it looks like a beige but it's so it's, a, it's a, like a this gray kind of mix with a um, natural beige it's nice uh, next so next is uh it's showing more green outside in the background which is nice and then it's just it's showing like a gray yeah it's a gray but really light gray okay, next here is more i think this is, is the one that it's just it could be more gray i guess it's just because the others they weren't 
to define gray but as it's getting better and this is the last wheel with we have a gray gray sofas and gray carpet and, and some gold and white things with a lamp and yes okay that's i think this is my last uh image and i hope you like this video and if you like please click a like and subscribe and i see you in our next video bye for now bye